Hey, I wanted to relate the story of how uh, a mini skirt helped me to become a dentist. And it's actually a story about motivation because it's when I was a, I think I was uh, a junior in high school, that was right during the mini skirt era in the 70s. And my, there happened to be a class, I think my junior year, there happened to be a biology class and the teacher had just graduated East Carolina and it was on that miniskirt era and she was wearing this lab coat. All the boys, all the guys wanted to sign up for the class. I mean, jocks, blacks, whites, every, all the young guys, I think, uh, you know, we're in the 10th grade and uh, I knew most of the guys in, uh, in there could not really handle a, a biology class only reason I jumped into class is like all the rest of them, she was wearing a mini skirt and it was shorter than the lab coat and she was fine. So Miss Bass, don't be embarrassed by it. But all the guys signed up for the class and I sat in the front and everything, I never aced anything. This is the only class that I ever aced in, in high school. And it's the first and the last, but she was like the, the earthworm, the frog, everything that she said dissect, I dissected. And the only thing she had to do was, Jerry did excellent. He got an A in the class. I mean, that was all she needed to do. And after that, I aced nothing else. It was nothing else that got an A. <laughs> it was the last. If she had taught, seriously, if she had taught calculus, I'd probably ace calculus. But after that, I didn't have any motivation. And I say all of that to say this. There's no shortage of knowledge out there. Knowledge everywhere, on the internet, in books, in libraries, everywhere. You could, the only thing there's a shortage of is motivation to actually go out and do it. And it doesn't have to be a mini skirt, but it has to be something that motivates you. And you know what? When I got in college, I was searching. I didn't know what I wanted to major in. I was almost majoring in going back home. And, um, and then I thought about it. I said, the only thing I ever did really well at was uh, that biology class. So I tried biology and didn't ace it because it didn't have the same motivation, didn't ace that class. But I found that that was the only thing that I had a natural aptitude really to kind of do well at. So I've done well before and I think that was the thing. It translated into confidence for me. So I had the confidence then to go ahead and do something else in biology. And eventually that led to dental school and owning my own business and becoming an entrepreneur. Thank you for the mini skirt. Thank you, Miss Bass and, and uh, your grandkids. Please don't embarrass uh, Miss Bass about that. But she was fine at that time and uh, motivated a lot of us and was a good teacher. Thank you.